Hello guys and welcome to a new video. In this video I'm going to com be comparing image stabilisation. Um, so what do we have here? We have the Sigma 150-600 contemporary um, 6.3 um, OS optical stabilised lens from Sigma and here we have the Canon 70-200 2.8 Mark II L lens with its IS. So that's image stabilisation, which Canon call, calls it. What I have noticed is image stabilisation, or optical stabilisation as Sigma call it, um, is very different to what the manufacturers tell you. So on the Sigma 150-600, the manufacturer g tells you that you get up to four stops of image stabilisation. Um, I can tell you that's not entirely true to my test. And in a short while I will show you what I mean. So hopefully this video will be informative. Um, and what I am noticing is the Canon image stabilization is twice as effective as Sigma's optical stabilization is. And I suspect that will be the same in the other manufacturers out there. Um, generally the prime candidates for giving you good image stabilization are going to be the top brands Nikon and Canon and Sony and um, the third party companies such as Tamron and Sigma are not going to be getting giving you great results because I do have another Sigma lens the 17 to 50 C lens which is used for crop sensor cameras um, I am noticing that the image stabilization is probably closer to one to two stops rather than advertised three to four stops. Same for this lens, this is advertised as three to four stops. Um, in reality, in terms of imagery, imagery that I'm getting, I would say it's closer to two stops. But the Canon, um, I certainly would say I'm getting four stops with it. Um, so what I'm doing is a test on image stabilization. So at 400 millimeters on the Sigma contemporary lens and 5.6 on the 70-200 with the three times extender this is the Mark III so hopefully I give you a good idea on how effective image stabilization is versus the third party to the premium brands and I hope this is interesting Right, on the left is the Sigma 150-600 contemporary lens with its optical stabilisation. As you can see, it's, I'm having a hard job keeping it very steady. On the right is the Canon 70-200L uh, Mark II with the 2X Mark III extender.